Amid uproar over the rape and murder of a trainee doctor in India's West Bengal, the Indian Medical Association, the largest organization of medical staff, appealed to Prime Minister Narendra Modi to come up with a central law to check violence against healthcare personnel. Also to declare hospitals as safe zones with mandatory security entitlements. Speaking of the doctor who was found dead at the Kolkata-based R.J. Kar Medical Hospital last week, the IMA said, I'm quoting here, the 36 hours of duty shift that the victim was in and the lack of safe spaces to rest and adequate restroom warrant a thorough overhaul of the working and living conditions of resident doctors. Pan-India protests over the doctor's rape and murder continue. Marches, candlelight vigils are being held across multiple locations in India as a sign of sympathy towards the victim. Taking stock of the situation, the central government has directed all states to submit reports on law and order situation every two hours. Kolkata police must have limited public gatherings around the hospital for a week. The Central Bureau of Investigation has sped up the probe in the case. The former principal of the medical college and hospital, Dr. Sandeep Ghosh, was questioned for several hours by the central agency yesterday and the day prior. He is to appear again today at 11 a.m. Indian Standard Time. Nursing staff, ward boys and security guards working with the hospital have also been questioned. Meanwhile, a five-member team of the Forensic Science Laboratory has reached Kolkata. They will conduct a narco test of the prime accused, that's Sanjoy Roy. Meanwhile, the West Bengal Health and Family Welfare Department has withdrawn the transfer order of 42 doctors which they earlier claimed were routine transfers. This after it triggered outrage, accusing the government of being vindictive. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.